Hi there. Just a quick message today. I'm in the process right now of editing and uploading the various files for our Sunday worship and Bible study today. Now it's become almost a tradition now for my family to join me for lunch here on Friday and then to go over to church and record all the hymns and the liturgy part of the service together. It's kind of a big production to get everything done and Sometimes it takes multiple takes, especially when Jonathan or Aaron, they want to add their voices to the mix more than what you might already hear on the videos. But you know what? I miss hearing other people sing and worship around me. I miss the sound of little babies crying in the back or the fussiness of little children during worship because a crying church means that we're a living church. I miss the little things about Sunday mornings. I miss the rush, the hustle and the bustle of Sunday mornings to get everything done, to make sure that I've got the coffee on for Bible study just the way that people like it. And I miss sneaking a donut sometimes in between church and Bible study. I miss being able to see your faces as I preach and, and seeing your reaction to certain parts of the sermon that, that maybe seem to touch you. There's a lot to miss. But in the meantime, we'll keep going this way, but look forward to the day when the rest of you can join us for church and for worship. And so today, as we wait some more days before we can gather together, let's keep on encouraging each other. Let's keep on praying for each other. Let's rejoice and sing out the praises of our God as we read today from Psalm 96, 11 through 13. Let the heavens rejoice. Let the earth be glad. Let the sea resound and all that is in it. For the fields be jubilant, and everything in them. Let all the trees of the forest sing for joy. Let all creation rejoice before the Lord, for he comes. He comes to judge the earth. He will judge the world in righteousness and all the peoples in his faithfulness. And so we pray. Hear us, Lord, let us continue to sing, pray, and rejoice in spite of our present situation. Feed us daily with your word and open our eyes to see all that you have so richly blessed us with. Continue to be with our world and bring healing, health, and encouragement to all. We pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. And so join us this Sunday for worship online and for continued study of the book of Revelation that you'll find both on YouTube or Facebook. I'll see you again soon.